so i say to the video camera that uh, uh, tawau is a very beautiful place yeah. and i met a very beautiful heart yeah. and a gentleman mr Thank lai you. in Thank tawau you. mr yeah. lai uh, handles straight forwarding and custom operations for incoming containers import and export in tawau an amazing gentleman he has his own company here in tawau and kota kinabalu uh, mr lai showed me around uh, tawau the customs area the port area how things happen how things so work but really yeah yeah i also met met me made us meet the port manager so the assistant manager assistant manager and the custom area and a lot of input and lot of learning of what happens in tawau hi guys i am in tawau i am in kota kinabalu lai also uh you know he's been in this field for i think oh more than 40 years 40 more than 40 years in this yeah. field of uh, trade forwarding yes so okay. shipping so agent. shipping agent so for example if mm-hmm. i want uh, uh ocean freight from tawau yes. to to say for example any port we can get from you yes i can check for you okay from other shipping line okay yeah okay. from other shipping agent Mainly, uh, Tawau gets what kind of shipping line? Might be MTT, MTT, and Transli, Transli. Yes, ah, uh, yeah, Sin Sinya. Okay, Sinyang. and also Evergreen. Evergreen, yeah. And what is your motivation to keep working when you are sixty-five? Also, what? You know, I try my heart that because for me, I retire since it's not a good thing. Okay. I will work until I cannot work. Right, right. nature will decide yes. god will decide yeah allah will decide yeah. <laughs> yeah and now you bring your son also into the business yes into the industry yes. to learn the business yes do you think uh, shipping is a very profitable business hope you have liked the video till here if you are someone who is looking to export your products into a malaysian market or any market as such and if you are looking for very real inputs I have personally curated a export course the link of which I have left here on the comment section if you are looking to learn practical experience my friends just join this link and have a look and see what is this export course all about I hope you will definitely like it the best if you get the ship owner appointed as an agent shipping uh, agent they uh, make their money you mentioned that you 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 have you make friends with the captains of the ship and yes, all yes a lot okay yeah, a lot yeah okay so then uh, if you have friendship with captain do you think you can uh, tell the captain to for the vessel to wait just wait my container coming oh okay, no, <laughs> cannot do that because he has to follow the shipping line also okay yeah Yeah, they have rules and yes, yeah, right. yeah. and tawau is uh, though you say it is a small port yes for me it looks like it is uh, recently a big port the vessels oh. the containers the oh is uh, tawau is the third third largest third largest in uh, in sabah in sabah okay. yeah kk is the first first sandakat is the second second yes okay. and uh, food clothes wood a lot of products come Yes. Yes, correct. Yeah. The population, I think, is only three hundred over three hundred thousand. But I think if a city, a town has a port, mm. which means that there is yes, more space to develop. Develop, yes. yes. And maybe it can become further developed. Yes. Maybe one day we become city. Correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Correct. But it's not my time. So I am sixty-five. May you live a long, long life. <laughs> no, I don't think I can live till eighty or ninety. Yeah, mm-hmm. good enough. If I can get, I uh, live until seventy-five. For me, seventy-five, eighty might be. Because I see, in, especially in Asia, uh, yeah, long life. Huh? Yeah, long life. I've seen. Yeah. And and when you see, you cannot make out. Yeah. And you also strong. If you are able to go around the world, you know, 
Yes. yes. Cannot just stay there. Yes. Relax, retirement. Mid waiting for die. Right. Yeah. No, and you put your purpose to work. Like you're doing trade forwarding business. Mm-hmm. You're still doing because that is the reason you're waking up every morning and want to go to work. Yes. Yeah, that you have the aim. Yeah, yeah. And even if you want to switch off, your customers calling you, hey, where my container? What happened? <laughs> right. So they will they will make you work. Yes. Yeah, yeah. In your 40 years of shipping experience so far, what and when the sh- uh, cargo arrive and cargo depart, mm-hmm. what all how varieties of cargo have you handled? Like, have you handled rice? Have you handled oh, mostly sugar? the short timber, short timber, short okay. timber, timber. Okay. plywood, plywood, uh, okay. Japan, and uh, all 40 feet containers. No, but then a break box service. Oh, break box. Okay. Uh, break box service. From some Tawau port itself. Yes, they okay. use the box to throw the cargo. Correct, correct. Uh, just at the anchorage. At the anchorage. Yes. Yeah, with the mother ship. Okay. And they load the cargo load. onto the mother ship. Okay. With the cranes and all. Yes, correct, uh, yeah. correct. Oh, so your major part of your work was into break bulk. Yes. Not containers. Bulk. Not container. Tawau so also export. Or only import? Mostly import. Okay. Because as I see, the many content, empty container is shipping out. Oh, that's empty mean, container. Okay. That does mean less export. Right. Yeah. yeah. So the import come and the empty containers has to go to either K- Portland or Singapore. Yes, yes. So I'm thanking Mr. Lai uh, to helping me out. I already feel I know him for many years. <laughs> so. I think uh, this friendship is going to last for a long time and we will definitely want to learn yeah, more so. from Mr. Lai about Tawao and the trade. Thank you. Yeah.